Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Dear students, Assalamu alaikum Nan zaman topic de Differences between amorphous solids and crystalline solids Dere makhki munga Classification of solid hua yo Aghi ki solids two types discussion ho show Yo crystalline solids au bal amorphous solids Nan zamanga topic de daghi pamans ke differences Che what are the differences between crystalline solids and amorphous solids De bani aksar exam ki question razi differentiate between crystalline solids ya true solids and amorphous solids Amorphous solids are also called powdered solids or supercooled liquids Let's start the topic. Serial number, property, crystalline solid and amorphous solid. Serial number one ki property shape pali hasara crystalline solid or amorphous solids ki difference was ek ko. Che pali hasi shape, pali hasi structure. Dekhi sir difference the. All crystalline solids have proper characteristic geometrical shapes sumrachi crystalline solids the crystalline solids the true solids the dagheba proper geometrical shapes the proper geometrical shapes matlab dare che they have proper faces proper sides proper angles and interfacial angles like that of sodium chloride having cubic shape on the other hand Amorphous solids do not have specific geometrical shapes. The amorphous solid geometrical shape nay. Why the particles are random arrangement, Godward arrange arrangement, there is no regular three-dimensional arrangement. No dekhi ba lagi shape ba proper ya geometrical nay. Point of difference number two, melting point. All the crystalline solids have sharp melting point value. Sharp means fix, specific. All crystalline solids have specific melting point values. And when the melting point is reached, all the particles of the crystalline solid get released simultaneously from their original positions. While amorphous solids melt over a wide range of temperature, as there is no regularity in the arrangement of particles in some direction the arrangement is on, uh, on uh, one pattern and in the other direction this arrangement is with another pattern regular arrangement is the Godward arrangement the interaction by your side ki dear the both side ki kam di your tarap the interaction strong di both tarap the weak di no, they melt over wide range of temperature the temperature fixed na the melting point na the fix na the fixed melting point matlab sodium chloride example the that this specific melting point at 7 degree C the and this sharp melting point is the identity of a pure crystalline substance the deep a madasar among the your compound purity malum or issue so whether this compound is pure or not kafaras ka sodium chloride melting point at 7 degree C Manga confirm ku no da pa peori ka art sevek degree si nai et min chi deki bia impurities mojud di an isotrophy another important property of crystalline solids crystalline solids are an isotropic an isotropic the variation in magnitude of a physical property with change in direction crystalline solids ki the physical property magnitude the direction change ki do sara change ki gi matlab that directional properties di yo side ki magnitude the physical property yo shan ko ka direction change kuno aga property aga magnitude ba ya kami gi ya ba seva ki gi no double difference show on the other hand amorphous solids are isotropic dab isotropic ki they have the same magnitude in the physical property in all direction. The direction depend na kai. Har tarap ta the physical property magnitude chide no aga yoshani mekdari yoshani. Point number four of difference is symmetry. Symmetry means similarity. All the crystalline solids have 
symmetry the property of symmetry these are symmetric when rotated through 360 degree similar faces angles appears more than once pa crystalline solids ki symmetry the similarity the yo shan wale de aur jo kale yo crystal the yo imaginary x is the tercha pera mang 360 degree rotate ko no similar faces similar angle ya interfacial angle ya edges da mukta more than once repeat ki dish no de ki similarity sta so there is no symmetry no similarity in amorphous solids there is no repetition of the similar faces after the crystal is rotated through 360 degree angle cleavage planes cleavage planes they crystalline solid cleave or break along a particular direction at fixed planes po crystalline solid ki proper cleavage planes hi pa yo proper direction ki da ki cleaving ki gi da ki breaking ki gi aur aga big crystal small similar shape crystal ta convert ki gi so there are no cleavage planes there is no cleavage of amorphous solid in specific direction no they do not break at fixed positions examples of crystalline solids are sodium chloride common salt calcium carbonate also called calcite copper sulfate into 5 moles of water also called nila tota diamond and graphite these are the examples of true solids and crystalline solids on the other hand examples of amorphous solids are a rubber plastic glass coal tar and gem stone students shortcut mang dasi vel issue che crystalline solid have proper geometrical shapes while amorphous solids do not have any proper geometrical shape crystalline solids have sharp melting point specific melting point while amorphous solid have no specific or fixed or sharp melting point crystalline solids are an isotropic while amorphous solids are isotropic crystalline solids have symmetry while there is no symmetry in amorphous solids crystalline solid have proper cleavage planes while there are no cleavage planes in case of amorphous solids so this was all about the differences between crystalline solids and amorphous solids thank you for watching